think I've, I'm, I'm doing okay. I, I actually think I could have probably lost a little more weight. Um, and I think the reason why I didn't um, was because I, being, being exercising and stuff, I was a little bit more hungry. And I think I probably could have made a few better choices as far as, you know, my carbs and stuff like that. Maybe a little more protein. And I think moving forward down the road, um, I think the journaling helps me because when I when I journal, I tend to lose more weight. So I, I'm gonna I'm gonna do that regularly, pretty much I guess until I get to my weight goal. And I haven't yet figured out what that is. My small weight goal is. Uh, is 230 pounds, which would be two thirds of the entire goal. I'd like to get to 200, but 230 would be two thirds of the way there. This program has changed your life. Um, well, I, I think it, it has put into my into my life exercise where um, I, I mean I I see the the benefits of the exercise in my health numbers. Uh, maybe not necessarily in my physique. Yet, but I do see some changes, that's for sure. But as far as my health numbers are concerned, I went from being a full-blown diabetic to, to my A1C hemoglobin being in the normal range. So, if, if that just doesn't say it all, I mean, what does, you know what I mean? My, my, all my health numbers went from way out of range to in range. Maybe some are just in range now, but they're definitely going in the right direction. You know, and if I take off a, f a few more pounds and stick with the exercise, I'm, I'm sure I'm gonna be, you know, in the normal range. Well, what do you plan on doing after the uh, competition is over? I'm gonna stick with, with this plan, you know, with, with Max, definitely. How about your eating plan? Are you gonna continue with that? Absolutely, yeah, yeah. How do you feel about Max Fitness? I like it, I think it's a good, I think it's good. I think you got, you push us enough, and uh, you know you keep us motivated for sure. I like the fact that every class is different. Okay. You know that that's what I like about it the best. And uh, how do you feel about Dr. Ben Moa? Uh, I can't say enough about her. I only wish I listened to her a long time ago. You know, it took me to the point of where I was in. You know, I was in danger for me to really wake up, but. Uh, I wish I would have listened to her before, but I guess like so many other people, we fall into denial, you know? The motivation was going to get my blood work the first time. I mean, it was night and day. Right. Well, you know, a lot of people, they have a fear of the unknown, and some people have never worked out, so they have, they're afraid of it. They don't realize the adrenaline rush you get out of it. Do you feel that? Uh, now I do. In the beginning, I felt a little bit uncomfortable because um, I, I, was, I, didn't, I wasn't able to keep up. And, you know, some of the people that are in shape, it's a little intimidating to watch them a little bit, you know. And, 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 and we spoke about this before. I think that that's why some of the other people didn't continue, because they didn't stay long enough to see any kind of benefit. You know what I mean? They expected to, you know, expected to work out three times and look like Melanie. You know, it just... Right. This doesn't work. I okay. also found, there's, here's the big difference between Max and the personal trainer guy. I, the personal trainer, when he was down, you know, when he was having a bad day, the workout okay. sucked, you know? But here, I don't, I don't, I don't feel that, you know, I feel, I feel the energy all the time. You know, I mean, I used to have back pain constantly. I don't have any back pain. How's your family see your results so far? Oh, they, my, my daughter was, uh, Daddy, you don't have a belly anymore. I said, I still got a little belly. <laughs> but I mean, she's like, you know, she used to tell me, Daddy, your belly's big. Now she's like, Daddy, I don't see your belly anymore. You know. Great. You know, and then my wife, um, she's probably lost about nine pounds since I started just because I've been cooking a lot more at home. We're not, you know, we're not taking in, we're not, we don't take food in anymore, really. I mean, uh, I think a couple of weeks ago we took in uh, Chinese food and I ordered like a steamed shrimp and vegetable dish, which I never, ever ordered from the Chinese restaurant before. 